Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am doing my nightly routine skincare, I guess. Um, I know with people with lupus, they fight skin discoloration, redness in their face, and you know, just things like that. So I'm always out there looking for products, trying to do treatments to treat my brown spots, like right there, I have them. I have done IPL, I have done microdermabrasion, I've done microneedling, everything. I've done it. And um, it's just, I don't know what else to do. So I did buy a new cleanser for my face. It is by Kills. I went to Dillard's. And it is the Purifying Foaming Cleanser. It's the Clearly Corrective. It says that the Clearly Corrective Regimen is clinically demonstrated to help reverse notice, noticeable skin discoloration for an overall improvement in skin clarity, helps restore hydration levels. So, um, even with my glasses on, I have a hard time reading the back of this. But this is what it looks like. This tiniest, tiniest bit will work all over your face. It is kind of like a cream, but it does go to, like it says, a foaming cleanser. I like it. I just got it yesterday and I've tried it a couple times and I really, really like it. So for my toner, I've been using this for a while. It's the SkinCeuticals. Equalizing toner alcohol free pore refining for all skin types because my pores are bad. And also for my skin discoloration from Skin Suticles, I also use the Advanced Pigment Corrector and the Metacil. I really like these. It leaves my skin feeling really, really smooth when I wake up in the morning. Um, I've been using it for a while, so this used to be a lot worse than what it is right now. I really wish I didn't have this because it really makes me feel ugly. And also, I've been using, let me just reach over here and get it, Kiehl's Midnight Recovery. It's an oil for your face. I'm all about skincare things like this. I'm always looking for new things to try and I'm always looking for a miracle in a bottle. For no matter what the price point is, I've bought an inexpensive, really, really expensive from Neiman's. Um, just willing to try it all. So if anybody has any suggestions other than going to a dermatologist or an esthetician at some, having some at home help here let me know and I will try it out but as for right now I've already cleansed my face so I need to tone it so I need to grab a cotton round excuse me I'm sorry I should have been prepared cotton round I'm going to put my toner on this Spray this a few times. I need my magnifying 15 million times mirror because I'm blind. So I'm really gonna hit oops these spots that I really have the hyperpigmentation. So anybody out there with lupus battling this, let me know because I would really love some tips and tricks and whatever you're using. To help this mess. Now that that's done, I'm going to use my Kills oil because I love the way this makes my skin feel when I'm in the wake up in the morning. It's really like really really baby smooth. So just a few drops. Put it in. Oh, love this. And I've recently been doing some research about what helps with the darkness under the eyes and the top five, ten things I've been looking on the internet. I'm always, always doing research. So I come across this thing where 
you need an eye moisturizer with hyaluronic acid. So I did that. And I went to Walgreens and I bought one. CeraVe. This is supposed to be a really, really good eye cream for dark under circles. So that is about $20 from Walgreens. And then I also went to Dillard's and I got one by Kills. And let me just grab over here. I think this one was about $50. And this one also has hyaluronic components in it, I guess. So I'm just gonna use one little drop like that. That's enough for both the eyes. And I wake up every morning praying that this is gone. So we'll see. Gonna test this out for a while and see if it helps. So, anywho, pigment corrector. I really try to concentrate on these spots that are really, really bad because like I said, they make me feel really ugly. And that's probably why I'm such a makeup junkie. I have all kinds of makeup trying to cover and hide all of this mess. So, and I also have something right there that I woke up with this morning. I don't have any spot corrector to put anything on that blemish. So hopefully using this will get rid of it. So this is basically my nighttime routine that I go through every single night. To, and I also use Latisse on my eyes, trying to grow up my eyelashes so I don't have to do eyelash extensions anymore, that, which I've been doing for about three years now. So my eyelashes really have not seen the light of day in about three years. So I'm trying to get those off, go out natural, use mascara, Latisse, anything that's gonna help my eyelashes grow out naturally long. So we'll see how this goes, but I will keep you updated. Thank you for watching. If you have any comments, suggestions, please let me know. Thank you, good night.